Rescue box, let's slide to the rescue. Hey guys, welcome to Show and Tell Toys. Alright, check it out guys, Transformers, and we've got all kinds of different Transformers here. We've got Transformers Rescue Bots Academy, we've got Siege War for Cybertron Transformers, and we've even got just regular Rescue Bots right here, and whoa, who is that? You know who that is? Leave a comment down below and let me know who that is. Okay, so in today's video, I'm not going to open all of these, but for today's video, I'm going to actually open... Rescue Bots Academy, look at this. We've got two different medics, the Doc Bot. Oh, look at that back there. It's Whirl, the Flight Bot. So we're gonna open just these four new Rescue Bots Academy characters right here. And then make sure you check back because I've got other Rescue Bots videos, Heat Wave. Whoa, look at this, Drake the Dragon Bot in green. Whoa, who is that right there? It's Quick Shadow, Quick Shadow Playset Flip Racer, and then uh, a Flip Racer of Heat Wave. And also make sure you check back for Transformers Cyberverse Toys. Those are Scout classes right there. Okay, so let's get opening on these Rescue Bots Academy characters. Okay, so first things first, check this out. Here is Hot Shot, and this is one of the main characters in Rescue Bots Academy, and boom. This is a one step, he changes right into a jet. So that's pretty cool. So here is a brand new Medix, the DocBot. Just came out, easy to do conversion. He's a one step as well. Puts the pedal to the metal to save the day. And this is Wedge the Construction Bot in orange. He looks kind of similar to Boulder. Boulder had a vehicle just like that. Wedge the construction bot smashes through obstacles to save the day. All right, cool. Maddox the dock bot, pretty cool in the white and red. He is an ambulance, of course. And to transform, he pretty much just put his heads down, put his hands down to the side, and push the top together just like that. And there you go. Maddox the dock bot. Then just raise his arms. There. Cool. What do you think of that? Pretty easy to do. Easy conversion right there. Medix the dock bot. Then we've got Wedge the construction bot. The snowplow that Boulder was at one time. All you do for him is you push his arms forward just like that. And check that out. That's a cool snowplow. It's still like a snowplow bulldozer. So it's cool. Okay, transform him up. Transform him down. <laughs> cool, and he's got wheels, so both of these roll pretty good as well. Here's Medics the Doc Bot again, a little bit bigger of a figure. First responder Medics the Doc Bot is ready to race to the rescue. Whoa, check that out. I bet he could compete with Chase, right? So there's a new vehicle. Kind of looks like a repaint of maybe Chase. Whirl, the flight bot taking over. Who? Blade Spot. Whirl is ready to save the day. Cool police copter bot, that's for sure. Okay, so let's get these out of the package too. Okay, so here we go. Maddox the Doc Bot, and as you can see, a lot bigger than this other version right here. Okay, so Maddox the Doc Bot actually got to push this out. Look at that. Whoa, that's pretty cool. It has like a tweezers or like a claw right there. His arms move up. What the back looks like cool wheels that's for sure but well, once again you just flip that out and squeeze that's pretty cool okay so let's transform them all you got to do is flip his hood up and put the wheels in and boom there you go there's the front got the autobot symbol definitely ready to roll to the rescue and go rescue some people especially since he's an ambulance he's got to get that quick and flip this out right here. Cool. Okay, so that's Medics. He's even taller than Wedge the Construction Bot. Okay, so here is Whirl, the Flight Bot. I would call it a Copter Bot, though. Okay, the arms move up and down. Arms moves up, move up and down. And what's cool is that this propeller right here, the blades can attach right to the hand. And you can either put it on this side or on this side. All you do is just push that button right there and it spins around. Okay, 
So to transform, bring arms in and put the feet together and then take this and put it right on top like that. And there you go, there's the copter or helicopter bot. Press this button. Rescue bots, let's fly to the rescue. Cool. Okay, so there is World. World looks like she's always happy. Okay, so there you go. You've got Hotshot, World, Wedge, and two different medics. But we're missing one, right? We're missing Hoist. Hoist is right there. So these are the characters. But you know what? I've got a surprise right here. What is this right here? Well, of course it looks like Optimus Prime, right? Well, let me tell you a secret. This Optimus Prime right here is just like Hoist, except he's in Optimus Prime colors. What do you think of that? So this is just like what Hoist looks like. I'm gonna transform, check this out. He's got a hook on the back, okay? You just flip this up, pull the arms apart, and whoa, check that out. So, of course, like I said, this is Optimus Prime, but the hoist figure is very similar, very close, look, closely looking to this one. So, what do you think of that? Transform hoist slash Optimus Prime. <laughs> so, that's a pretty cool figure. Okay, Optimus Prime, and transform him again. Like that, and you stand him up. Flip his head up, just like that. Oop, gotta flip this up. There we go. Gotta flip this down, I mean. Okay, so there you go. What do you think of that? That's pretty cool. So let's just pretend this is Hoist slash Optimus Prime. All right, so there you go. There are the Rescue Bots Academy figures, but make sure you check out the channel for these other videos that we're gonna make as well. All right, well, that's it for this episode of Show and Tell. Make sure you check out our channel for more Transformers, Rescue Bots videos, uh, Siege War for Cybertron videos, Cyberverse videos, and for more exciting toys. All right, check it out. It's Transformers Rescue Bots Bumblebee. Oh, yeah. With lights and sounds, all right, let's transform this Bumblebee. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That's awesome. Bumblebee, geared up and reporting for rescue duty. <laughs> awesome. Check out my emergency lights. Check out his emergency lights. All right, so we've got this Bumblebee that transforms just like that. That's pretty cool. And then, let's see, we also have, oh, we've got an Optimus Prime. And whoa, look how big he is. He doesn't even fit in the in the screen how big are you optimus prime this is the optimus prime from the flip racers trailer so we've got an optimus prime and we've got a bumblebee but what about this bumblebee now that's teamwork <laughs> check that out That's right, Bumblebee will be there. He doesn't transform though. And then we've got a, whoa, look at this Optimus. Any problem, any time, I'll lead the way. Activate the Energon Saw. Okay. <laughs> Check out that Optimus Prime. Oh no, trouble. All right, so what I wanted to show you was a Bumblebee and an Optimus. A Bumblebee and an Optimus that don't transform, but now guess what? I've got some new toys to show you from a brand new TV show, and one is Bumblebee. Here we go. Oh wow, look at that. Transformers Rescue Bots Academy, and these are Mega Mighties. This is a poseable figure for Bumblebee. Whoa, look at that. So he's about as tall as this Bumblebee right here, but he looks a little bit different, doesn't he? So from the new show, Rescue Bots Academy right there, look at all these new characters we're gonna see, is Bumblebee. All right, this is awesome. So I don't have an Optimus Prime, but I do have a, whoa, check it out, a brand new Hot Shot, new character from Rescue Bots Academy. Look at this guy. 
Hotshot is recruited by Optimus Prime to join the Rescue Academy. So that's why I showed you Optimus Prime. Okay, so Hotshot. Wow. Cool. Okay, so this is opposable. Hotshot is ready to race in and save the day. I wonder what he does in the show. And then check it out. You can also get Bumblebee. Boom. You can also get Hotshot. Okay, so these look pretty cool. These are what the boxes look like. So if you want to check them out at your local store, this is what you're going to be looking for. All right, Bumblebee is ready to lead the way and save the day. Is ready to race in and save the day. Okay, cool. All right, let's get them out of these packages and check them out and see what they do. Here we go. This is what they look like out of the box. They're pretty cool looking. They've got a lot of good designs and a lot of different paint added to them. So here is Bumblebee. And let's see, his arms move. These are just posable figures. So that's what his shoulders move like. You can put his hand up or go the other way. Or his head even turns. And let's see, it turns all the way around too. So that's pretty good. And then his legs spin all the way around. So you can kind of put him in different poses. You can kind of turn him, make his head go like that, and then move his arms like that. You can kind of turn him sideways like that. Okay, so that's Bumblebee, and then you've got Hotshot doing the same thing. His arms can go all the way up and around. His head spins all the way around. His upper body can just twist and just start punching. <laughs> Nothing bends at the elbow or at the knees or anything, but that is what Hotshot does, okay? So, what does this remind you of? Well, what about these right here? Whoa! Those are the big giant rescue bots that basically only did this and their head turned and legs moved. Okay, so no kind of twisting at the waist. So these ones are also pretty cool because now you can take Cody and put Cody inside. Optimus and Chief Burns. You can ride inside. So these are very similar to these newer ones from Rescue Bots Academy. So I really wish that maybe they could have carried a character inside. But with this new show, there aren't a whole lot of humans except just Cody. So everybody would have to fight for Cody to ride inside. Okay, so what do you think? Leave a comment down below. Let me know what do you think of these cool opposable figures. Look at this in their hand. You've got this little star pattern right here, which possibly means that they might get some tools or things to put in their hands. Bumblebee has it, and look in the back, you've also got it right there. So I wonder if there's gonna be extra tools or attachments or weapons or anything like that to be able to put in these little sections right here. So there you go, there it is Hotshot and Bumblebee. Do you think there's gonna be more characters coming out? Who do you think? Whirl, Wedge, Hoist, or Medics? You think they'll come out with some as well? That would be pretty cool. Then we could get a whole other collection, just like we did with these two. Chief Burns, you come on out. Stand right there. And Bumblebee, come on, Cody. You can stand right there. So this is the height comparison too. If you already have one of these Transformers Rescue Box, just a little bit shorter. Let's see Optimus and Hotshot. That's about the difference right there. All right, so what do you think of these Transformers Rescue Box? Leave a comment down below. And let me know what do you think of this new Rescue Bot Academy show. It's pretty cool. All right, well, that's it for this episode of Show and Tell. Make sure you check out my channel for more Transformers Rescue Bots Academy videos and for more exciting toys. Hey guys, do you like video games? Well, you need to subscribe to the Show and Tell Gaming channel to check out all kinds of awesome and fun gameplay videos. Just watch what game we're going to play next. See you over there.